A new media company is making a splash in the Silicon Valley as it attempts to create a new lifestyle brand geared toward domestic living. Brit and Company is the brainchild of Brit Morin, who is said to be the Martha Stewart of the digital age. Although the company has only been around for a year, it has already announced a $1.25 million seed round of funding as well as an app called Weduary that allows couples to create their own wedding websites. Brit is joining us now by way of Skype to tell us about her exciting new venture. It's great to have you today. Britt. Thanks for having me. Nice to be here. Thank you so much. Well, Britt, you were formerly employed by both Google and Apple. So what really led you into this direction of domestic living? Uh, you know, it's funny. I, I have always enjoyed technology and I left Google last year after about four years. I was just taking time off and I found myself embracing one of my original hobbies growing up, which was making stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and I, down the road, I, I learned that I loved making things online and offline, and yet there is no one who is really teaching this new generation that grew up with technology how to do things in both of these worlds. And so I really wanted to spread some of my knowledge to this new class of people who are interested in getting creative themselves. Very interesting. Well, getting into Brit specifically, can you tell us what it's about and really what your vision for the company is? Sure. So Brit is a new lifestyle brand that teaches this digital generation savvy shortcuts and creative living ideas for their online and offline lives. And everything we do has a little bit of a tech flair. Um, because I, we're here in Silicon Valley, we're always keeping up with the latest trends with apps and gadgets and even just interesting, clever ideas of new ways to do things in and around the home. And so what Brit is really about is inspiring people to be more creative, to simplify their lives through uh, the content that we distribute as well as some of the software that we're creating. And we are building a whole new suite of software applications for each one of these lifestyle categories, ranging from home to food to weddings, like we just launched last week. That's great. We'll get into that in just a minute. But on several occasions, you have been referred to as Martha Stewart 2.0 or the Martha Stewart of the digital age. But do you feel that this association is, is really fitting for what you do and what your goals are? Um, I'm totally flattered that I've been referred to Martha. I think she's, <laughs> she's an icon. She's a household name known around the world. I think what's so interesting about what I'm trying to do is, is spark a whole new industry in Silicon Valley and in technology where we are building tools for cooking and cleaning and decorating. And it's what I like to call lifestyle technology. And I think that's where the parallels between myself and Martha come about. Um, and everything we're doing does relate to a, a younger generation as well. Right. Well, in one report that I read, you mentioned that you were looking forward to all the ways that, that Brit can integrate with television. Can, can you share your idea for this with us? Yeah, you know, my, my last job at Google was working to launch Google TV. And when I was doing that, I saw so many um, new ideas and new ways for content creators to build interactive media properties. Um, and so I'm looking forward to a future of smart television where people can be teaching, um, you know, how to cook a new recipe or how to paint your walls a new way. And the audience at home can be following along and interacting and clicking on different products to purchase them. Um, I think we're entering into a whole new revolution of television and media, and I'm excited to be a part of that. Absolutely. Well, you mentioned this a little bit earlier, the fact that, that you incorporate technology into everything, but it's not, it's not in a complicated, overwhelming way. So do you think that this appeal will, will really resonate better with a broader audience? I mean, if you are like anybody aged 13 to probably 60, uh, you probably are a multitasker who has a job or has something that they're doing all the time and has very little time to do all the stuff you, you really want or need to do around the house and in your life. And so for me, it's really about what are the shortcuts, you know, what are the clever little ways that you can do things and get things done and have fun doing them and make it look beautiful and, you know, inviting people over to entertain or cleaning your bedroom or coming up with a new way to style your outfits every day in the morning. You know, it ranges in all of these different categories, but that's sort of the goal is I know people are busy and I want to help them simplify their lives mm -hmm. in a smart way. Very interesting. Well, as you said, Brit and Company also recently introduced Wedgeware, which was apparently inspired by your wedding last year to Path founder yep. Dave Morin. So tell yep. us about this app and what it does. 
Sure. So Weduary is a new way to create a social and beautiful wedding website. It started when uh, we were planning our wedding last year, and I was I was a little appalled to find the lack of social software that exists in the wedding category. You know, this is the social era. Everyone's on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram. Yet um, this is a category that was missing the social touch. And when you think about a wedding. It's the one, one of the biggest events in your life, and what really matters to you as a bride, and this mattered to me as a bride, was that all your guests are having a great time, they're connected, they're not being awkward you know, in their corner because they don't know everybody else. And so, Weduary is a new way for you to connect your guests together ahead of time, um, and they can meet all the other people that are coming. We actually suggest people for them to meet based on the things they have in common and the friends they have in common. Um, each guest has a profile on the site, so you sort of have like a mini social network of all your guests. Nice. And one of my favorite features is called Flirt. Um, <laughs> it's where all the single guests go to see who <laughs> the other single guests are. Um, and they also can match their interests and see who to meet as well. So we're, we are having a really great time with it. We have a lot of new features coming um, in the coming weeks. Mm -hmm. um, and we've been really excited about the, the really positive response we've gotten with the product. That's great. Well, there are already a, a lot of big wedding brands, as you said, and, and also domestic living brands. So how do you think that that bread and company will really stand out from these existing brands? So I think one of the primary things we're doing is we're combining the media and the software company together into one. And even here in Silicon Valley, I haven't seen many people do that at all. Um, we're, we're really focused and dedicated to creating really great content um, led by me who, who's sort of teaching this new class uh, of people as well as creating a new types of software that relates to the content and also relates to the need that these users have in their everyday lives. You know, there are just so many opportunities out there in this new world of lifestyle technology that I think we can, we can hopefully fill a few voids in. So on that note, can we expect future apps from you? Absolutely, yes, definitely. We intend to create a whole suite of, of applications, uh, both on the web and on mobile. And uh, you'll have to wait to see what our next one will be. <laughs> All right. And lastly, in terms of the, the recent funding, congratulations on that, by the way. Can you give us any insight into how this will be used? Absolutely. It's definitely to scale the team right now. Uh, we, we definitely want to grow our engineering staff. Um, we'll probably add on a few more people and so we can build these apps and continue launching more features and creating more great content as well. All right. Well, it's definitely an exciting concept. And thank you so much for sharing it with us. We look forward to seeing more. Thank you. You're very welcome. For more information on this new lifestyle brand, visit Brit.co. I'm Abby Johnson with this Web Pro News Report.